Google has announced that it's changing its name to Alphabet. Hi everyone, I'm Sasha Wood, this is IO, and I'm gonna tell you about an interesting branding decision right after the intro. Start, I have to ask you guys, how many hours do you spend online? I know for me, too many. If they were to do a study, it would look like I have a really big problem. And for most of us, we use Google as our search engine of choice. Well, they announced on August 10th in a filing with the Security and Exchange Commission that they want to create a new security holding called Alphabet Inc. The filing claims that this new name is meant to represent the company's new structure. So going in order from one thing to another, lots of letters in a row, I don't really get it. Well, thankfully, the CEO and co-founder are more than happy to explain. For Sergey and me, this is a very exciting new chapter in the life of Google, the birth of Alphabet. We like the name Alphabet because it means a collection of letters that represent language, one of humanity's most important innovations, and is the core of how we index with Google search. However, fear not, you will not have to look up your fan fiction and porn on the search engine Alphabet. Google the name is here to stay. Alphabet will become the name of the holding company, however, lots of the well-known aspects will retain the Google branding, including the maps, the search engine, and apps, and of course, YouTube and Android. We all learned our lesson about well-known things changing their name when Prince tried to go with that symbol and just became the artist formerly known as Prince, which is still Prince. So way to dodge that bullet, Alphabet. I feel like I'm talking about a cereal or a kindergarten class. I don't know. I'm just not really feeling this new name. Not as much as Sergey, at least. Later in 2015, all Google shares will change to Alphabet shares, but the shareholders will retain all the same rights they had before. Despite the name change, the company will continue to trade under the tickers Google for the Class A shares that carry voting rights and Goog for the Class C shares with no voting rights. So do you like the new name? Do you get this branding decision? Is this the best thing since when Facebook changed its font? Let me know down there. Basically, this will affect a lot of internal areas and not a lot of external ones. So for us, we're still going to be using plain old Google. I'm Sasha Wood. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. More videos over there. And of course, we'll see you soon.